Okay, so let's talk about a pretty common one these days, and that's the reverse copywriter. So if you're unfamiliar, a copywriter from Be Boring and Street Dance looks like that. So if we want to reverse that, right, around, we want to reverse that and have a sensation now of coming the opposite direction. So let's talk about just the copywriter portion of it, and then we'll talk about how that's often incorporated in contemporary work. Just for the basic level of this, Let's start at just a lunge, so you have the correct arms and legs everywhere. So if we start with your left leg forward and your right leg back, right leg back and long, left leg bent, what we want to think about is shifting weight into our right hand side so that we can release the left leg up and swipe the right leg under the left. So from here, I want to put weight into that right hand, swipe this right leg under the left. So we're gonna take that right leg back here, lift that left leg up, weight into your right hand, and swipe that right leg under the left. The way that this is used very often in contemporary forward is, instead of coming to the ball of your foot, which you would do in a normal coffee grinder, you have to come to the top of your foot so that you can soften into the floor and continue on into something else. So for example, we can come here, and now I'm gonna go to the top of that left foot. So I'm on the top of the left foot and the left shin, and then I can push to continue into anything else. Right leg comes under, top of the left foot. I can drop that pelvis down toward the feet as well, and then push from that right side to the left to continue on to whatever you wanna do. You can push away from that left foot and then the right to come to here. You can also tuck that left shoulder so you can open into your X again, and then from your X you can go anywhere you would like to go. A lot of different variations for this as well. But that's the basic. Starting from a lunge, coming under to return to a different place. If you have shorter arms, one way to help offset that is to one, put weight, put more weight into your right side but two, to actually swipe that left arm up toward the ceiling. So really swipe it up so you can feel your energy rise and that'll help your pelvis go a little bit higher as well. So from this lunge, I can really swipe that left hand up and that lifts the pelvis a little bit higher from the floor as well. 